Welcome back to another quick and dirty video. So far we have done SKSE, SSE Edit, SSE Auto Clean, and just a little bit more, but right now I think what we need to get is some engine fixes. So let's go online and grab those. Links, of course, are gonna be in the description of this video. So for engine fixes, you're gonna to go to the link that's in the description. You're gonna to go to the Files tab, because you wanna get the one for your version of Skyrim. I am the one for 1.6.11.70, so I wanna mod manager download that one. Now, as you can see, it, requir it requires address library, so you click the link and it will open up address library for you. This has no requirements, so what we're going to do is we're going to find the one for our version of Skyrim. Again, go to the Files tab. 1.6.11.70, I want 1.6.x, Mod Manager, download that. So now I have address library, C++, and SKSC64 we did in like the first video of this series, so now we're safe to download our Engine Fixes Part 1. And for Engine Fixes Part 2, we have to manually download this to install it. So you can see Engine Fixes Part 2 has been manually downloaded. So let's go to our Mods tab. There we go. Address Library Part 1 Engine Fixes. So let's go to this Engine Fixes Part 2. Now, this is going to go in D, Steam, Steam Apps, Common. You know exactly where we're going, right? We're going to the Skyrim folder. Okay, we want the main folder. Now, for Engine Fixes Part 2, right-click it, Show More Options, 7-Zip, Extract here. You're going to take all three of these DLLs, and you're just going to plunk them in your folder. I forgot I did this already, because this is my second time shooting the video, so I'm just going to replace the files. You shouldn't have that pop-up. That's because I screwed up. Okay. So now that that's done, I'm going to go back to D. I'm going to go to my Mod Storage area. And I'm going to take this Part 2 Engine Fixes, and I'm going to plop it over here. That way I have it if I have to do this again. Uh, when you've screwed up as much as me modding, this was a trial and error for me to learn. You learn to do that. All right. So that's Engine Fixes and Engine Fixes Part 2 installed. You're done with that, right? You've got our library Engine Fixes. Now we need our Modified Toml. So again, we're going to go to the Files tab. Modified Toml version 5. This one you have to manually download. Ignore this button. Manually download it download. Alright, so now that is in our downloads folder. Now we need to go over here to our Vortex Mod Staging folder. If you don't know how to find that, let's open up Vortex. Up here at the top, you can see in the orange bar above the Mods tab, there's Open. And there is Open Mod Staging folder right there. So you're going to click that. And that takes you right to it. Nice and easy, right? Now if I could just get this damn thing to cooperate, we can continue with the video. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're going to open up Part 1 SSE Engine Fixes, SKSE Plugins. Now you have these four. You're going to want to do Engine Fixes, the Toml file. Not this one down here. Not that. You want this one. Engine Fixes, Toml file, delete it. Okay. Back in our Downloads folder, you're going to take that modified Toml you downloaded, Show More Options, 7-Zip, Extract here. Open these up, and you have a new Toml. So we're going to drag this over and just drop it in. Now, as always, whenever you got to manually download something, at least when I do, I stick mine in a mod storage folder. So I have DMOD, Skyrim mods. Anything I manually download, I plunk over here. That way I have it again for later, and then I can keep my downloads area nice and clean. So now we have part one installed, we have part two installed, we have the modified Tom installed, we even got address library along the way, which is a requirement for a lot of mods. Let's deploy. Now, since we changed the Tom, you're going to get this pop up. Don't freak out, this is what we want. SSC engine fixes, use new file, confirm. That's it, you're done. Engine fixes is installed. Congratulations. Have fun. I'll see you in the next video.